What's up, guys? We are going to do a smell, smell, smell session uh, with Katie Brown and her daughter, Claire. Claire is going into seventh grade. And so, she's taller than me. And she's taller <laughs> than Katie. Um, <laughs> if you're watching this, it's the replay. Comment replay just so I know. But we are going to smell the Bring Back My Bars. Uh, that are available right now through the end of the month, which is not very long, right? Well, it's the fifth. It's sixteenth. Hi, Mandy. Um, it's the sixteenth. So we've got <gasps> what? My June, name. July. That mm. we got fourteen days left. So, and uh, just a reminder that all of these fragrances, like I said, are only available this month. They are uh, bring back uh, my bars. So they were discontinued before, and a lot of these have never been back before and may never come back again. So if there's one that you love and you hear the name of a scent that you've been missing, hi, Rebecca. <gasps> oh, she got so excited. I love her so much. <laughs> um, her so that was much. a really squeaky laugh. I'm sorry. Um, so add them to your club uh, so you get them forever because if you are part of Scentsy Club, they will make the bars you have in your club for the rest of your life as long as you are subscribed. So if you can't live without Love You Very Much or Zeppelin or... I'm trying to find one on here that didn't exist when you became a consultant. And I don't uh, I think even I'll, maybe know. Maybe Root Beer Float. I think you're right about. Ooh. So if you can add them to your club, you'll get them for life, like I said. So we're just going to start smelling. These are not in any sort of order, but I will read the descriptions. So what's that one? Coconut, vanilla, orchid. So you guys know that we are honest. So oh. some of you like smells, some of you... Some of you guys like smells that I don't like, so you know that if I don't like something, you'll love it. Some of you have similar scent tastes as me, so you know that if I love it, you will as well. Um, so we're gonna we are gonna try not to be crude, but we will be honest. And some of you like that, some of you don't. It's fine. Um, this is coconut vanilla orchid. This is not that old. Listen, and it's orange zest, coconut milk, and silky vanilla orchid. I want to tell you. I would like to preface by saying that I love this smell. I love this smell. However, when I just smelled the butt. I got a whiff of a mixture of bazooka and tampon. You're welcome. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> but I love it in, like, the best way. But she so does great. love the smell. I love it. So I had, um, since he sells uh, scented, scented greeting cards to consultants yes. every, uh, every season, and this scent was one of the I love it. scents of those greeting cards that season. So when I smell this smell, it reminds me of writing notes to my teammates. I think it um, smells really good. It smells like what... Blackberry ice cream tastes like. <gasps> You're right about says that. It smells like what blackberry ice cream tastes like. That is 100% true. You're I have right to... about that. Mm -hmm. I love that smell. I it can see that. Good in, yeah. um, it smell. It can see that. It is a really good smell. It's a really good smell. This one was fantastic in body, but it's very good. Coconut vanilla orchid. Hi, Marissa. Hi, Dylan. This smells exactly like what it is. What's that one? Root beer. Oh, yeah. Root beer float. This one's really good. It's concoct. It's. <sighs> A concoction of old-fashioned root beer and creamy vanilla ice cream. It smells literally identical to a root beer float. An A&W one. An A&W one, she says. You won't like it because you don't like root beer. Why? It does smell like what I feel. Because there was like one time that I tasted root beer. Or, oh, um, when I went to Flat Rock, they had this like plant that they put in root beer. It was like... It, it was like sarsaparilla. Or oh, I bet you're right. And yeah. that's what it, this is what that tastes like. I didn't like it, but but it, it smells like it does like it. smell exactly. Yeah, like this root is beer exactly float. root beer float. So if 100%. you like a nostalgic kind of fragrance, I love these kinds of smells in like Everett's room. They're really fun. Caramel vanilla delight. Caramel vanilla delight. Vanilla ice cream, liquid caramel, and a splash of white rum. I smell literally all three of those. You smell the rum. Mm -hmm. Yep. It smells like ice cream topping to me. Caramel ice cream topping. So if you like smelly smells that smell like baked goods, there you go. Like she says she doesn't like this. <laughs> it smells like, like a weird It kind of smells like buttered popcorn to me. It smells like caramel. It's like kettle corn. Melted. It does smell. Butter. It smells like buttered popcorn. Like a buttered sugar popcorn. Kettle mm -hmm. corn. Okay, flower child. I love this one. Our oh child my gosh, I love this one is sweet so red berries layered over wild gardenia and sandalwood. Mm. 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 <laughs> yes, Lord. Give it to me. Get your face I love it so out of it. She loves this one. I love it. 
That one is really it's good. Like mild. That one is really good. It's mild. It's flower. like it's a very feminine woodsy it's smell. It's just so if you like the way that men cologne scentsy smells smell like this is like a female version of that. Throat, like peppermint, like the smell of it, the fragrance. It's burning the back of your throat. It's like tickling. The it's tickling. It's tickling her. It's strong. Let us not take clear opinions <laughs> into account. She says she had, she had to poop. Did you do Enchanted Mist? Not, Not yet. Not yet, Rebecca. I will save it for you. Uh, so that's delicious. I really like Flower Child. This one's really good. Debating on putting that one in my club. I love that one. Buckleberry. Is it's a bite of summer's bounty. This is Buckleberry. A bite of summer's bounty bursting fresh with berries atop a buttery blanket of crumbly coffee cake. Sounds like Winnie the Pooh would eat it. It smells like a... Or be around it, not eat it, because it's not honey. I'm looking this way. I'm sorry. I need to look at the in camera. In a very complimentary way that this smells like fruit snacks. It smells like fruit, fruit snacks. snacks. I love fruit snacks. It's a snacks. very complimentary comment. She means it nicely. It smells like fruit it snacks. Does, it smells like fruit snacks, kind of, yeah. It does. It smells like a combination of fruit snacks and, like, craisins. Oh, craisins I, is right, too. I mean, yeah. I can see it. It must be Welch's, I like though. That one. It definitely has like a cinnamony undertone, Is that though. Is weird that I was going to say Welch's, too? Because yeah. that's what went through my brain. Welch's are good. But it's very much snacks. berry. There is a cinnamon undertone. The coffee undertone. cake is probably the, sm- the smell. There's Sorry. A- the coffee cake is probably the cinnamon smell. Yes, you're correct about that. Is it what? supposed to be named after Huckleberry Finn? Buckleberry? Go it's with no. Buckle- Buckleberry is a real thing, I believe. A buckleberry. No. Like oh, a buckleberry, it? yeah. What is a buckleberry? Here's an answer from Wikipedia.org. Buckleberry is a village. And civil parish it's a village in West Berkshire, in West Berkshire England. Eight it's kilometers. That's like the same thing as a snozberry. Sure. Who's ever heard of a snozberry? Okay. England. Summer rain. This one's delicious. I Dew sprinkled one. cyclamen, fresh botanicals, and a pinch of black lava salt. This just Black smells good to me. Salt. I don't know how else to describe it. This one's just a really good. clean, ozonic smell. Very rain. Hi, Megan! Christina, you said ozonic. You're exactly right. I was taught the word ozonic at boot camp in 2012 by Sensi when they were showing us how they make their You're fragrances. You're 10,000% correct. It's ozonic, which it is the name for, like, those airy, like clean, like, outdoorsy smells. Um, like a flower petal would taste like. Smells the way she thinks a flower petal would taste like. Like, or grass. I can see that, Not yeah. Wrong. Not Maybe wrong. you're going to go chomp on some grass. This one is very good. If you like clean smells that smell like rain and outdoor air, it's summer rain. This one's so good, summer rain. I'm just going to keep club. commenting because, oh my God, I love her so much. Please do keep commenting. It makes Simply us happy. Simply irresistible. It makes us not feel them. alone. Simply irresistible. Simply irresistible. Are you saying that because we're losers? We don't want to feel alone? Yeah, I want to make sure that... Can you read the description? Uh, lavender with a strong woody background of amber moss and musk. I love this one. Moss this smells moss. like what moss you would musk. need to use if you were ill. Like... That, if, you it you were vaporizing, if you were vaporizing Scentsy, this would be what you would vaporize. Interesting. I'm not sure. She's like, ew. She's not cool. It's This one's really wood good. Wood and paper. Wood and paper, she says. I love that one. This one's very, very good. Definitely has like a, some, I think there's eucalyptus in it. It doesn't say it's so, but it has like a, a little bit. It's very therapeutic way. Yeah, it's got, it's like, a very like masculine smell yeah. how much of lavender notes are there not no, very not, many not a whole lot it's I'm definitely sure. not a top note my only sure. sunshine this one's delicious super good one. start your day with a smile as you experience golden tuberose and jasmine balanced by sandalwood vanilla and glowing amber i love this smell so much i remember when it this came this one out. is very very good it's just if one. you the the name of the scent describes it so well yeah it's a very cozy sunny floral cozy sunny oh my it's like gosh. it's like a sunny day hug it's very delicious. But you know what at the same time though is that it remind it reminds me of something. It like reminds me of something from my youth, like personally, but I don't I can't put my finger on what. It's probably why you like it so much. It's probably I a good love memory. It so much. Hi I Crystal. Love I love it. Hi Crystal. I don't know who you are, but you're it's so a spa great. smell, she it's says. So great. Yes. That is a very good spa smell. It's a very comforting comforting floral. <laughs> 
if anyone knows like Sensi's florals from if you have been around since like 2010 and 11 or earlier Sensi's florals were a lot f less fresh smelling like they were very like perfumey and now they are so much more authentic like they smell like a true flower versus like a floral smell it smells like flowers and fruit snacks smells like flowers and fruit snacks claire I love says it smells so much oh my gosh i remember when this smell came out and i loved it so much okay i'm gonna shut up blueberry pancakes this is a very popular fragrance blueberry and butter accord over light maple make the mood what what? I don't know if that's the right description, but it's blueberries, butters, and maple. Yeah. Oh, what does that smell? Hold on. Blueberry ah. Eggo waffles. Blueberry Eggo waffles. It's blueberry Eggo waffles. It smells very blueberry. It's very blueberry. blueberry. Eggo waffle or blueberry pancake. It doesn't smell like Ow. pancake -y. It just smells like blueberries and like sugar. Blueberries and Literally, sugar. Literally, you, you didn't grow up in the 90s. When blueberry ego waffles. You need to have a blueberry ego waffle. This you smells like understand. Okay. If you grew up in the nineties and you bought the art stuff stuff from Bed Bath or Bath and Body Works, the glitter art stuff. Like the blue bottle has glitter in it. It's it was sweet. called art stuff. It the blue bottle, that's the smell. I just think it smells like blueberry Eggo waffles. I love that, this smell. Google it. I saw something if you want your that, house to um, smell like blueberry breakfast, that's... It says that your, Bath and Body Works, they only have eight smells, and they just rotate through them, and then they just rename them. <laughs> Blonde wood and moonflower. Pale warm wood and amber. Envelop demure moonflower. Delicate white roses and upturned lilies. What is an upturned lily? Um... Deadly. Not a downturn, Lily. This one smells like a swanky 1970s mid-century modern house party. Like a, like a. We'll see about that. Smells like velvet and wood. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Everything I in this scent is orange. Like to pr You're right, but let me tell you what <laughs> I think this it smells orange like. Orange and brown. I also would like to preface by saying that I do love this smell. However, if I scent it and then you rescent, you're going to tell me that you think it smells like Carmex. Go ahead. Carmex. I don't know. A little bit Carmexy. I, I can see. In a positive way. Sounds like puke. Yeah, that's can not smell, nice. Can I smell it? No, it's a really good smell. That one's oh, is it because I said orange and green and brown? What? This is Everett. We're on a video. Everett's going to be in it's sixth already grade. Smell it. Don't oh, look. Sixth He's oh. asking for his screen time well, passcode because he wants to keep playing. Here you go. Yeah, All right. Why does it smell like sweaty paper? She says this smells like sweaty paper. It's delicious. That's inappropriate. This is a fantastic, very boutique, very swanky smell. Boutique is a good way of putting it. I it's love like that smell. It's a very, com it's a very complex it fragrance. It really is. You is that blackberry and orange marble lead? Love you very much. Close this enough. This is love you very much. And it is bursting red berries, dreamy white peach, and tart cranberry, finished with a splash of vanilla. Smells. This smells like, um, sounds like something a good. brunch cocktail. A brunch cocktail. 100%. It, looks, it, it smells, smells like chocolatey berries, I feel like. <gasps> That's also correct. Christina, you are an expert. Me. I'm proud of you. I didn't even smell it. I just remember it. Good job. It's Dark like, chocolate. It's like a strawberry glaze on top of brownies. You're 100% correct. Like, what, like if you walked into a candy store and it, they had like a bunch of fruit candy? It also smells like if you made a teddy bear that was supposed to smell like berries, it would smell like a teddy bear that smells like So that's the Valentine's smell. It's a Valentine's Day smell. That's a Valentine's smell. It might have actually been, I think it was a Valentine's Day smell. Oh, I thought the person No, it wasn't. Was I remember when it came person. out, it was part of a summer collection, I remember. Berry of Paradise. Or maybe a fall, I don't know scrumptious sugared strawberry bird of paradise and vanilla bean i do not like this scent I like not even a little wait berry of paradise didn't we have bird of paradise at some point too i mean it's, it just smell doesn't like. smell so if you like light fragrances that smell clean with a little bit of fruit Christine. that is that one i just Rebecca it's not Steel. strong enough i heard the word sweat twice that's from this one this one <laughs> apparently smells a lot of sweat and has a lot like of sweat to compare anyway. to 
It just, it just smells like a plastic scented toy. I've just never loved that smell. It smells like a plastic toy that they were trying to make be yeah. scented. And that was a smell that I had on hand for years because I couldn't sell it. it smells, I'm just being honest. So. It smells like, like, a, scratch, like a scratch and sniff sticker. Like a scratch and, and sniff sticker. It way. is like barely a fragrance. It like if you want to warm something that lasts for three hours only oh, geez, and does not scent your whole home, it's that one. I really just didn't love this terrible. fragrance. Okay. I will. However, it was voted back. So someone loves it. Go ahead and say, I don't like this one either. Is that cutie pie cupcake? No, it's, it's very Perry pumpkin and I don't know. Oh, like very Perry pumpkin. Again, if you, it is the same thing as pumpkin marshmallow, which smells like pumpkin straight out of a can. It so like it's earthy, savory pumpkin. Food. It's, Pumpkin baby food. It is Gerber it's baby not a good. Like of all of the fantastic pumpkin smells we've had, very peri pumpkin is not ah. on the list. <laughs> it is not that on the smells list. Smells disgusting. Yeah, it's not good, guys. It smells like oh it's my salt. gosh! It literally smells like you just opened a can oh, right. of Libby's pumpkin. Yeah, it's salt. It's like you made pumpkin pie and forgot to add the sugar. Yeah. It, it is straight like out of the can pumpkin. It's not a good pumpkin. So, very peri pumpkin, don't buy it. I'm I mean, you can. Someone voted that back. Someone likes it. But we have had so many fantastic pumpkin smells, and that is just not on the list of our best smells by any means. Can you describe inner peace, please? Inner peace is earth. In, in the Scentsy way and the Christina way. I haven't way. smelled it yet. No, I don't remember it. In the Christina way. You can do it. I'm good. literally just going to read this. Okay, fine. And I haven't smelled that yet. Earthy wood notes with, this is inner piece, earthy wood notes with the unmistakable scent of lemon groves and rejuvenating cypress. This the one's, description is 100% correct. Like an essential oil that you would diffuse. This is an essential oil, but it's also Your baby. meditation room. It's an essential oil, but it's also baby wipes. Baby wipes. Oh it's yeah, that one is baby wipes. Baby wipes. Baby wipes. It doesn't really smell like anything. You don't know. So some people can't pick up musk smells. Did you know that? Like they can't smell that kind of smell. It smells like a really blandly scented bubble bath or Clorox. Clorox wipes like, or a bland bubble listen, bath. Listen, y'all, it's baby wipes, okay? I it's, really like this one. This is a I good smell. Like it. It's a good smell. It's I smells, can, so it's this smells, like bathroom smell. it really does smell like you're cleaning something. Yeah, it's a good smell. Yeah, I like that smell. I really, really smell. like this smell. It smells, it's okay, if you go into Lush and you were to buy a citrus bath bomb from them, that's what this smells like. I like that smell. Oh, yeah. I didn't remember that one either. Okay, I can't get this out of here. I, I couldn't get another I one of them out. What is that one? Out. French toast. All right, French toast, French toast French is French a perfect toast. slice of bread dunked in golden egg batter, dusted with powdered sugar, and finished with a swirl of sweet maple syrup. If I remember anything about this fragrance is that you can smell the egg. Mommy, look, I got it out. You Good can job. smell the egg. It smells exactly yeah. like French toast. No, like, I didn't. it smells exactly the way that French oh, toast I can tastes. smell it. It may not come out. Ooh, it smells like, it kind of smells like cream cheese, too. Cream cheese? It's a very, very true baked goods smell. I got it, smell. I got it. It's like a it does, the egg is for sure. There's egg in it. And you smell the egg. It's so weird, but it smells exactly like French toast. Like, exactly. Like the batter. No, you're right. It smells like, like it French cooking. French yeah. toast doesn't have batter. This is very it's good. Bread has eggs in yeah, sugar. it's no, there's no French off. toast batter, Katie. That's pancakes. Step off, yo. I mean, she called you out first. Mm. She's 12. She she's did. allowed to. She is my offspring. Okay. No, she's not. What am she's I saying? She's not allowed to. I'm allowed I'm to. She offspring. can't. That's Wait, true. What? You're right. Let's be real. Lemon coconut chiffon. This one is melt in your mouth lemon custard layered with butter cake and sprinkled toasted coconut. I love lemon stuff. It's like a lemon pie. A lemon, gonna love a this. lemon bar. It's like a lemon bar, Anything probably. Anything related to Or a lemon. lemon meringue pie kind of smell. She says no. It's like a lemon baked it goods smells like, smell. It's a lemon cake smell. It's like a lemon cake smell. That doesn't smell like lemons. It smells too sour. Uh, yeah. it, smells, it smells like lemon bars. It doesn't I like it. Yeah. It doesn't, it doesn't it smells a lot smell. like squeeze the day with like a baked good undertone. Wow, we gotta speed this up. No, we're okay. It was at like twenty four percent when we started. Praise be. So it's only gone down four. So my battery. Which handmaid's tale comes out in September? You're welcome. It has nothing to do with my battery life. It's okay. You You're said, so funny. 
I don't know what we were... I literally said I nothing. You just felt like sharing that information. Is that bamboo yusu? Yes. <laughs> Is Imagine a Japanese garden... Gar- imagine a Japanese garden as you breathe in dewy bamboo, tranquil lotus flower, and fresh yusu with hints of sage. Where did I come with that? Do you know? Because I don't know... Where. I don't know why you said that. It's just on your mind. It came in somehow to what... I don't know. Mm. I love Maybe this on the smell rewatch. Too. I love this smell. This one's I very, very good. It's a very fresh, sweet bamboo. That, that, to me, that is that Kylo person, Ren. I don't know who that is. I know it's from Star Wars. I yes. don't know who exactly This is. smells like. And I keep looking at it and I'm just like, oh, it's a person. I know. <laughs> okay, so to me, this smells like cleaning stuff, but not all at the same, but like so much better. Like it smells this like. This one's just so good. It smells like Mr. Clean floor cleaner, only not. And I don't know how to describe it. It smells like if you it. want your house to smell like an oasis like a or a massage yes. parlor or like a place where you just go to relax and oh breathe deeply, gosh, yes. that is the smell. That's it is so perfect. True. Bamboo Yuzu is one of the most perfect fragrances. It smells it's like so lemons true. and like the lawn after it's been cut. The lawn after it's been cut in lemons is what Claire says. I think it smells, it's just a very fresh, um, exotic, oh no, green, I'm it's a green oh smell. Christina. Well, I don't know why Stop you're doing that. Stop dropping things. There you go. Stop dropping. Okay, I'm sorry. I apologize. Roll. Blackberry orange marmalade. This one is orange marmalade and blackberry jam over sugar crystals. Not so much. Too much. It's a very fruity, very fruity sugar smell. It's... After, after, when you first, like, when you first sniff it, it smells like fruit, but then the second after, it smells like... It's got like, a sour note to it. To it me. does it have a sour. Like, it smells like hot chocolate when but you made it with water. It smells like those sour rainbow candies, or rainbow ribbons candies. It smells like fruit at first, and then after, it smells like what hot chocolate smells like when smell you use water. Chocolate. No, like she says it smells hot like chocolate. hot chocolate when you use water. Church hot chocolate. Church hot chocolate. There Don't you guys go. Don't listen to this at all. I like it. And the hot water makes it not smell like chocolate. Okay, forever yours. Is uh, sweet creamy lemon and enchanting jasmine, a rhapsody of devotion. I do like this smell. Devotion. This is up there with my only sunshine for me. It's right up there. This one is a very nostalgic smell for me. This is one of the first scent of the months, I feel like, when I first started that I deeply remember making samples of. It's a very good floral, lovey-dovey romantic smell. I feel like that came out when Christina Stainbrook was like, like I'm in this. Very with airy flowers. Very airy flowers, yes. This is a Christina Stainbrook is all in scent. Like, I'm all in. It wasn't by scent. any means my favorite smell. It just reminds me of a time where I think that things were just heading a good direction, yeah. right? All in Christina Stainbrook scent. Yeah. Okay. Uh, cotton candy Oopsies, cookie? I accidentally took a little sliver off of this cotton Hot. candy cookie. It's ruined. I don't like this one. Ooh. Little, this is Maybe cotton candy like cookie. It. It's little hands clutching cotton candy and cookies. While gooey treats topped with sugared raspberries beg to be tasted. Put this it is, in your nose. That does not sound like a good thing to bake. It's a very youthful baked good smell. At first, it smells like sugar. Mm. It smells like sugar cookies. Like frosted sugar cookies. Or like, I feel like what... It just smells like wax to me. It doesn't... It smells kind of like buttery and vanilla. Buttery and vanilla. I like it. It's like a definitely sugary smell. Sugar cookies. Like fresh, like buttery sugar cookies. I see the the sugar cookie part. It kind of smells like body splash. Like you'd wear it in the 90s. I'm getting the sugar cookie a little bit. But I'm also getting like an astringent. Crystal says she hates it. Her 18-year-old daughter loves it. Hi, Brittany Daly. Don't you get like a little bit of an astringent type Astringent or what? something like a little means, for your. I don't know. This don't one's know. really hard to describe. I don't know. If I you don't like bake, if you like baked goods, you probably will actually like that one. It's very, very vanilla uh, with do, like a sugar cookie, like, like candyish. Like, so it, at the end, it smells like a sugar cookie. At the beginning, it smells like um, almond, like a tiny, tiny little bit like almond extract. Okay. Okay. Sounds I like great. it. Beginning is almond extract. Zeppelin. And is 
Sugar Free. Zeppelin's fantastic. This was back when they were naming like all the guy smells after people, which I liked. Uh, it was refreshing citrus, green sage, herbaceous vetiver, and earthy sandalwood. All of my favorite things. This smells like the men's cologne counter, not Hollister or Abercrombie. Von Maur? Von Maurer. Or Mons. Macy's. Did you say mm. Maurer? What? What's the Have difference? you been saying it like that your entire life? What is it? Von Maurer. I am not from Indiana. <laughs> it's okay. Hi, Amanda. I'm from Indiana. Claire's not going to like this one. It's a man smell. Straight up man smell. Very, very green and cologne smell. It smells like pepper and grass. That's true. It's very it smells cologne like cologne smell. Look, it's very good. If like I say golfer. it smells like pepper, yeah, that's it's it smells a very, like a golfer. It's a very high-end male fragrance. Like if you were to picture a 75-year-old man on the putting green. Is that one love and happiness? Yes. Glazed chestnut, vanilla, and sugar king divine temptation. I don't know if Marissa is still on this one, but Marissa smelled that at my house and said, This is the feminine hygiene aisle. It smells like fragranced pads. Thank you, Marissa. It if also you're still smells on. like rubber bands. Rubber bands. That one, though, I think. Um, it does smell like I feel like it smells bands. like powdery deodorant. Yes. It's a very powdery floral smell. It is powdery. I think it smells like women's restroom. But a lot of people like that smell. And I'm, so it smells like women's deodorant. restroom it's, at Sears. Yeah. So it's technically it a very like classic floral powder smell. It if you smells like, like baby powder. It does. If you like newborn nursery and you love like lilacs and violets or whatever, you'll like this one. Chantilly powder from 19, Chantilly powder. From 1953. Okay. Is that one? Yes. I'm trying to guess. Cutie pie cupcake. Yes. Okay. Pie Sweet cupcake. clementine and yellow cake batter with vanilla and sugary icing. Hi, Lazy Hoseman. Ah, I love her so much. Tell her I said hi. I love her. I think I know who that I is. I can say hi myself. That was a love and happiness, Lacey, that we were describing. Is, is the Lacey person, is that the lady who's an art teacher? Yes. yes. Lacey, we are now smelling. that you're an art teacher, you're welcome. We are now smelling cutie pie cupcake. Nope. Which is Don't like it. wheat clementine yellow cake batter. Clementine and yellow cake. It's exactly what it is. It's literally like an orange creamsicle cake. Like orange cake. It um, does. Are you really? I, I, I like, like to very mildly. Like Our husbands cake. are right there. That's okay. I want to maintain my humility, but I also want to let you know that I definitely feel like your video is going to get like 20,000 more views now because I'm on it. You're welcome. <laughs> Probably true. Okay. Uh, Enchanted Mist. Enchanted Mist. This is for you, Rebecca. I hope she's still on. Is she this still watching? This is... I'm sure she is. Hi, Janelle! How are you? Hey, and yeah. then is that... Okay, yeah, that's Janelle. Hello! Hi, Janelle. Um, what is that one again? Enchanted Mist. Enchanted Mist. If Rebecca yes. is on here, this is the one she wanted. Romantic blend of juicy apples enhanced and sweetened by rose petals and rich jasmine. Listen, the apple is high. Yeah, your dad just popped on. Hi. <laughs> the apple is a high note. How it do smells you like, smell like red, delicious apples. Oh yeah, it smells very much like if you were like going to get like a <laughs> apple, an apple it's body splash. Red. Yeah. <laughs> she knows. It's like an apple body splash. <laughs> this is the last one. Okay, it's okay. We did really well, good on time. Like so sad. Which one's that one? Pineapple, coconut, vanilla? This smells I love this one so much. Juice. Oh, I was wrong. Coconut, vanilla, orchid was not the note cards. It's this one. I was wondering. It smelled I different. I confused when it's you this said one. Listen, I need to question you more. Coconut, this vanilla, orchid is delicious, but it's not the card smell. That's this one. This I need to question you more often because I thought you were wrong. Yes, mildly like apples, enchanted mist. I thought that you were wrong, but then I was like, Christina would remember. Also, if anyone smelled Enchanted Mist back when we sold it, this smells like a revamped version of it. This smells really good. Like this, this is, is much way different. stronger than the OG. This is much more stronger than the old Enchanted Hi. Mist. My husband um, just came. That is what one very pineapple. Handsome. You said that's better than the OG. He was like, "No, the Enchanted Mist is." Yeah, that Enchanted Mist is exactly what you would have wanted it to smell like. I don't think it smells at all like old Enchanted Mist. It smells like the way it was supposed to smell. Old Enchanted Mist smelled mostly like wax. Mostly like old wax. I agree with this that. This one's fantastic. Listen, you have to read the description first. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Read Coconut, pineapple, blush, and blue fig. They were really lazy with that one. Pineapple? <laughs> really you know what? It didn't need more. 
They didn't flourish it. It didn't need more. I love this. It smell. is a, I'm going to make it up, a palm hanging coconut with a juicy poking out of the ground pineapple that just saw its crush and is blushing. And I don't know what blue figs are, Amen. Um, it's a fig that is blue. <gasps> My other baby! Hi. Hi, Liza. That's Hi, Liza. Cl- That's Emma? Yes. Oh, there Coconut, they are. pineapple, Come blush, here. and blue fig. Probably I don't really face. think it smells like any of those things. Um, but it does smell like the note cards I wrote to my team. Wait a minute. No, Lacey no, wait, wait, wait. Hoseman says that she wants us <laughs> to make a six pack. Listen. Excuse fit. me, Eliza. It smells. Who's your best friend? I'm going to make a six pack. Yeah. It smells like flowers. Absolutely, I like I'm making a six pack. This has to be on it. This, this is part of my six pack. This is my six pack. Um, uh, well, French toast. She wants French toast in it. Flower child, absolutely. I was looking for one. Oh, put summer rain in it. French toast. And she says French toast. I disagree, but we'll give her one. And then what do we want next? Forever yours? Eh. I don't know. I could go inner peace, Zeppelin. I think inner piece or Zeppelin. I I'm going to say inner piece only okay. because I feel like it matches more people's taste. All right. So if Claire wasn't here, it'd be inner piece and Zeppelin. But this is inner piece as a six pack. If we were doing a six pack, it's inner piece, Claire's favorite French toast, summer rain, flower child, bamboo yusu, and blonde wood and moonflower. I do love it. Oh, you're welcome. Those are available to the end of June, unless you add them to your only Cincy Club and then they're available June. forever. Only June. June. Not July. No. Not Don't come crying to me. Not September. July 1st. No. Not September. No. Don't come crying. Not December. You Only can't get this for Christmas. Only you can't. June. Hey, what's your name? Emma. Unless what? Are you? What do they have to do to get them forever? Yes, I'm a kid. Cincy Club, if you want to get them forever. Yeah. Add them to your Cincy Club, and then you can get them in September, and you can get them in December, and you can get them whenever you want, as often as you want. But for the rest of your if you are not natural a life. Isn't Christina so great? Christina so great? A lot happening right now. But if you're not, your whole right. entire life. My, but your whole life, Eliza says. But, but if not, you're going to die. Okay, bye. bye. <laughs>